Alright guys, hello, what's up and welcome to this channel. So if you want to play Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness at 4K at your big TV, right, in your living room and customized, have you hear me right, customized Pokemon from the start of the main adventure and you can be the right place, the right channel, I hope you're gonna subscribe and like the video so other people can see it too. So let's go and let me show you the re something really cool before I start the tutorial. So not saying some main story guys I'm in pirate town pirate town and I'm playing at the moment as well uh, through the game because some people have explained in my old videos that it's crashes and empty battle look at this Charmander shiny bruh and we have Bulbasaur <laughs> come on okay and of course um, what would be Pokemon without the legendary trio, right? From Gen 1. So if you're a Gen, Gen 1 Jenner or Gen 1, then you uh, you for some treat, bruh. Touch Bomb uh, at, I don't know, Machamp. I'm just gonna show you even that it's Squirtle. There you go. And of course, keep in mind you can have from Gen 1 to Gen 3 all the months. Hello, what's up and welcome to this channel. In this video guys, I'm going to show you how to play Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness with uh, any Pokemon from Gen 1 to Gen 3 in the main. Uh, so for this tutorial, we're going to need four things. You're going to need Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness, the ROM, and we need a save file. But the save file we're going to get when we start a new game. Uh, we need Dolphin Emulator and we need PK Hex the Hardness. With anything further ado guys, let's hop to my desktop and let me show you how you get the experience that I have at playing my, the game with my Charmander, Bulbasaur and Squirtle and the shiny Charmander of course. Yes, let's do this. Alright guys, as we are my desktop right now, we're going to need three things as I told you in the intro. So I already opened it in the my, uh, web browser. We're going to need a uh, Dolphin emulator. I'm going to leave of course every link uh, every um, link in the description below so you don't need to have to go to try and error. Just click on the link and you're going to get directed to the web page so you're going to be here guys if you use windows go for the of course go for the beta version guys it's the stable one it's not going to crash and that's going to give you headaches because the development version is literally they every time they do something new they just put it out but it's not checked on and not proved this one is stable and if you prefer stable i think you do go for the windows 64 here this is the latest one every time it changes uh, then you need PK Hex the hotness as well as it tells you. I'll leave a link in the description below. Don't need to go try and error here. Just click on download this file and it's gonna download. And for the last thing, this is gonna be your uh, Pokemon XD Gale of is ROM. Unfortunately, I cannot give you the link for that because hey, it's pirating and it's illegal. But um, as you might see on the screen, Google is your best friend, Twinkie Face you know what's really good and with this out of the way guys let's start with the tutorial so what you need to do here guys you need to play so we start the game um, um, yeah, we're gonna go through this I already played through so what you need to do guys I just gonna just gonna like come on game All right. So what you need to do, guys, go when you got the RAM, got the emulator, go go inside here. It's going to ask uh, when it's create a create a save file, create a save file, and play through, catch the bear, and save your game, and then just get, go out, as I do. I already played through, get a little bit longer, and add to HDR. Uh, there we go. So. When you got it says I told you guys I just want to be accurate here. You go to you go you create you go to the game, start the game, play with you and you, and you get catch this Teddy Rusa. Then you got the first uh, environments. You're gonna have the save file. And you might ask me how do I get you the save file? Easy. When you did that and you played and got this Teddy Rusa, go to your open your dolphin emulator as I did. Uh, highlight the game. Right click. And there you're gonna see open GameCube save file. And from here, guys, just gonna do whatever you want to. You wanna drag it out from your desktop, or you wanna 
copy and paste it inside the folder it doesn't really matter and you're good to go you got the save file you good to go close everything then both emulator you're probably going to download it's not a big deal either then when you got your save file right you got the bear you got your save file you open pk hex guys just like that right put it here to the side go to pokemon xd gale of darkness this is the save file just drag it drag it it's easier than whatever just easy and you're gonna see the pokemon that you actually catched in the game here's your party this is my party at the moment i don't like how pk hex is doing it it's like it's never there's nowhere like a big screen thing but anyways this is my party right here you can view them with right click and you can change whatever you want to but we are here for another purpose you can do whatever you want but what we want we let's see we want the chair result right chair result inside here there's a chair result guys we're making him level jesus level 50 we're giving him a timid nature because he's uh, special uh, hold item give him what hold item whatever you want we're going to give him some charcoal uh yeah ability guys it's did they only have the only one here that there's nothing too crazy blah 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 make him shiny just like that met doesn't matter in this game if you don't want to play legit with anybody with those pokemon then don't you don't need to uh, bother about this thing go to stats and here you're just gonna we're gonna just zero those if we can find the zero yeah, zero all the stats just like that and then put like let's say you're on a special one to was it 55 and like in speed 255 so because special attacker is going to be speedy it's going to be a special attack and speed and we got timid, timid nature so it's going to boost the speed as well you did that moves here you can uh, click on it it's going to make it like legit but anyway as i said the possibilities are endless let's say <laughs> um blaze kick charizard with uh, hold up man oh god aurora beam uh, jesus let's see bro coal mind this is new meta guys and uh, we go for flame chore yeah because why not and flame chore right this is only for the tutorial sick guys if you did all that and you're happy with what you did you can give him uh, ribbons and stuff you can do richie whatever you want we see we're happy with this result we at least 50 a timid blah 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 Cl right click on the field and set and it's inside the game so now it's inside our save file file export save you click on your save file and you save on it you want to play pokemon xd already exist do you want to replace it yes we want to replace it and we click ok then we close the game because it pick hex hardness we see you just want the cherry zone now what you need to do guys hop to dolphin um mark highlight the game right click open gamecube save file and hold up we're gonna to go to pokemon xd of darkness we're gonna copy that save file that we moderate moderate it and replace it just yes replace it and we good to go now if you open dolphin and we start the game hopefully there you go everything should work as we want to and uh, we got our shiny charizard level 50 with uh, the super cool moveset here so let's check it out wait for the intro this, this is always nostalgic you know let's see if everything worked this is one two and just press on start it's gonna it's gonna recognize the the the, the bleh, your memory card it's gonna recognize the the save point okay i gonna just move out of here and go literally to this place here because i know i don't have to go to all those thingies 
So let's see if the Charizard is in our box. I could put it in our party, but I don't want to because I just want to show you its works. Oops, hold up. Pokemon Center should be... Hold up, this way, PC. I don't know how loud the music is and what not because I don't hear it, I don't have a headset on. Let's go to our PC. Storage. What in the hell is this? Firefly in Charizard 50 shiny. So move it. Z. We gonna remove you and put this guy here. Let's go out. Let's go to a battle. I wondered if this old man gonna battle me. But I already battled those. Let's see, do you wanna battle me, bro? Okay, cool, perfect. I love it. I don't know if I put him in the first place or in the last place, I don't know. Let's see. Okay, I didn't. I'm just gonna swap. Um, because I'm playing, the, I'm going playing through the game because some people have been complaining um, that they have some some problem. It crashes. Espion, my favorite. I just killed this dude. Talks. I hate it. All right, Tedros, I go out and Charizard coming in. And there's a shiny sparkle. Yeah. Let's see if the moves work. One shot without a doubt. There's no way it's taken it. Alright, Charizard gained some experience spells. You see, it's been recognized as a Pokemon. Another one, alright. Poison Sting. I love the animations. It's 4K HDR guys. If you want, I'm gonna show actually as well how to how to do that. But it's gonna be for another video. Charizard here. Blaze Kick, Aurora Beam, Blaze Kick, bruh. Blaze Kick, Charizard on the Dutox. And uh, yeah, Confusion on the Butterfly. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Alright, guys. As you might see, it works and it works perfect. Uh, so far, I played to Pirate Town and nothing happened. The game never crashed. And whatnot. Uh, so yes, I'm gonna keep on playing through it with the settings that I got right now. And I, if nothing happens, I'm gonna do another video where I can show you what sense you're gonna, what you're gonna use, so you don't the game don't crash for you. With anything further, ado, guys, I'm gonna get the heck out of here. Have yourself a good day. And else, keep it cool and stay awesome. My name is Emu for Emu Gaming. Hey, not freaking out of here. Peace.